let's talk about what meditation and mindfulness are, how they're alike, how they are different, how they support one another, and finally, why to practice both. A lot of people use the terms meditation and mindfulness synonymously, and while they are definitely related, they are not the same. A meditation is a formal practice, which usually involves a specific position or activity, like walking, along with focusing our attention on some form of anchor. That anchor could be our breath or our bodily sensations or an object or a mantra. Additionally, it involves cultivating a mindset of acceptance about thoughts or feelings that arise during the practices. Mindfulness, on the other hand, is more specifically a quality of the mind or a way of living characterized by non-judgmental awareness about our moment-to-moment -moment experiences. Practicing mindfulness can be done anywhere, at any time, and includes awareness, presence to the now, and non-reactivity to our thoughts and feelings. You do not have to meditate to be mindful but you can become more mindful through meditation. Additionally, living mindfully can help develop and deepen your meditation experiences. As you meditate, you can become more mindful. As you live more mindfully, your meditation practice becomes easier and more significant. That all said, there is a specific type of meditation, mindfulness meditation, where the two overlap. Mindfulness meditation, as the name suggests, is where you practice mindfulness formally as part of your meditation, perhaps focusing on your breath, a body scan, or a specific emotion in the here and now. Research suggests that mindfulness meditation practice can ease the symptoms of a variety of health conditions, including high blood pressure, pain, irritable bowel syndrome, anxiety, depression, and insomnia as well as helping with smoking cessation. It is generally accepted that mindfulness training changes the brain in ways that improve the brain's ability to process information, slow the impacts of aging, and decrease the emotional impact of chronic pain. A handful of studies have investigated the impact of mindfulness-based stress reduction, or MBSR, on veteran populations with positive results. One study found that as few as eight weekly sessions of MBSR, a one day long retreat, was able to decrease the severity of PTSD symptoms in veterans, effects which lasted at least two months after the sessions ended. Another review of studies in veterans suggests that alongside primary psychological care, mindfulness-based interventions can decrease the severity of depression and help decrease relapse rates as well. A mindfulness practice can also have positive benefits on mental and physical performance. Perhaps most important is that mindfulness meditation is a safe, cost-effective, i.e. free, and portable tool that doesn't have wait times or other barriers to getting started. It's a way to take control of your stress and develop better awareness of how your mind works. I hope this has been helpful. I look forward to sharing more about mindfulness and meditation in the upcoming videos. Until next time, take care.